hello guys welcome back to the channel the film is over here and today we are going to look at how we can set up a dumpy level the first step is with the tripod we start by loosening it so you raise and then adjust the tripod to a suitable height that you want and then you lock it So the most important thing here when you are setting up the damp level is to set the instrument to your height and then your height i mean you make sure that the head of the tripod which is the top part top flat part over here reaches what your neck level so as to avoid too much bend and then too much stretching whenever you want to read your instrument so as you can see this the head of the tripod over here is to my note to my neck level the other, other part is you stretch the legs and then make sure you stabilize this uh, machine firmly into the ground by pressing the foot part into what firmly into the ground the reason why we press this tripod firmly into the ground is to stabilize the instrument setup the setup that you have made for you to be stable us to avoid any slight what disturbances into, into the machine so just as we have set it over here whether there is a heavy wind or anything it is very difficult for the machine to what to move or destabilize now once you have our trapper stabilized the next thing is to get to the machine itself now this is a dumpy level and this is a type from al132 and this is the damping level that we are going to set up with today. So what you do is, we are going to put this damp level on top of the tripod over, the, over here. Now, once you put it on top of it, there is a screw over here that we fasten it to the base of what the damp level. So now you put the damp level on top of it, and then we fasten it. We fasten it to, to this screw. Make sure it's fastened to the screw. So that what the damping level is being held onto the top of the tripod or the head of the tripod very well so once we have the damping level fastened onto the head of the tripod like this the most important thing is to level this machine now with the damping level there's a principle behind it and then the principle behind this lamp damping level is that you have to maintain a horizontal line of what sight and now this the horizontal line of sight is being maintained by setting up or centering the bubble inside this what inside this dampy level to get your horizontal line of what of sight now when you look at the side of the machine over here there is a, uh, there is a circular bubble over here yes so with the principle you have to get this bubble over here this round circular bubble you have over here inside the circle or the inside the center of this black circle just so that we can get the machine in a horizontal position to get out a horizontal line of sight according to the principle behind the operation of what of this machine as i said we have two ways we can what we can set up that bubble to make it fall into the center of what the circle so i said we have the fine leveling and then the rough leveling so the rough leveling has to do with adjustment of, of the legs to get the bubble close or close enough into the center of the black circle and then the fine level has to do it using this foot screws that we have over here to do it now to carefully get this bubble into the center you are going to just as i said you are going to adjust the legs so wherever you have the bubble falling that means that place is what is high and then you have to bring that place what low or we have to get the opposite side up or high so the bubble is at this side you have to get that side what low so we hold it and then we decrease that side a bit then we come to this side we decrease this side a bit as well now the bubble is in the center of of the circle and the next thing to do is to 
bring it closely or almost in the of what the black circle that i was talking of so i've used the legs to do a rough leveling to get the bubble closer to the spot, center of the circle now, the next thing is for me to what, use the foot skills to get it very or near to the center of what, the circle so what i'm going to do is to adjust the foot skills a bit and now it's in the center of what the black circle that i am what, talking about come over and then let's have a look whether it's in the center or not so just as you see over here you can see the bubble line in, in the center of the black circle so to know that this machine is set up correctly you have to rotate this machine 90 degrees in any direction and if the bubble happens to still be in the center then it means we are hot we are good with the setup of this machine so i'm going to rotate this machine 90 degrees and now let's check whether it's still in the center or not so yes once i turn this machine 90 degrees you can see that the bubble still lies in the center of the circle meaning that our machine is what is set up correctly so whichever direction that i'm going to move this machine to take what my measurement i'm going to be in a horizontal line of sight to get my readings according to the principle behind what the use of this machine and that is that so that is how we set up a dumpy level on site if you find this video helpful please like and subscribe for more exciting videos on the family diaries in the next video we'll be looking at how to take readings and then calculate reduced levels with a dumpy level see you there